Okay, so what we're going to do here is install this dot job options extension for saving our um, PDF so it's the right format for the publisher. So if you've got some sort of document open, just open your Photoshop basically. Um, go over to edit Adobe PDF presets. It's down towards the bottom. Then you should get this uh, pop up here. We're going to hit load. Then find that this job options from, you know, that you've saved from the email. Find that wherever you saved it on your computer. I put it right here in the switch folder. So there it is right there. Boom. So they just hit open. And that should be good to go, right? You're not really going to see any change or anything here. Just hit done. So now, say if we got this and we're going to save it as a PDF. So you can do your save as. And I'm just going to make sure I put it somewhere where it's not actually going to do anything. Okay, so we got format. I don't know if you're Mac or PC, but your drop down for your format here. Find a PDF. Save. Now here's where it's going to be, right here in this first top part here. See it says Adobe PDF preset. And it's that one right there. Boom. One thing they also want is to have the color conversion. So we're going to do this convert to destination. And mine's already in there. It's this one right here. Working CMYK US web coded SWOP version 2. And if yours isn't in there, if it's not the right one, just click the drop down menu and locate it in there. And that's it. So then you just hit save. I think typically I would flatten everything too, but just make sure you don't save again, like save over your Photoshop file if you want to retain the layers, don't save over that. So that should be it, that's good to go.